Here we are, and you see our brand new playable character, Barbara. She's the badass redhead who's got an axe and she knows how to use it. Um, she has lots of cool new moves, as you can see when she flies, the little wings on her helmet uh, help her fly. And she's got an axe that she can slide on and other people can stand on. She's got um, all kinds of crazy power moves with the axe. Now, one thing that we have here, you can see, are these swarms of dark creatures, these crazy bad guys. And luckily, Murphy's there to help out because he can help move the swarm of creatures and uh, give a nice little space for Barbara, Rayman, whoever's playing, to get through. You can see we're doing a lot here with the lighting in this level. Um, the, there's a lot of there's a constant glow coming from the lava below, and then different lava streams that shoot out. Now here you'll see that we need to in, in Rayman Legends we need to free the Teensies. Last year was about helping out and freeing the Electunes, but now we're freeing Teensies. Now keep an eye on Murphy here because she's gonna tickle this monster, <laughs> and then that allows Barbara to take him out. Here's another example of the lighting. If you shoot these fireworks, it takes out the dark creatures and creates a space for Barbara to, to run. Now this part of the map is for all the Rayman fans out there who want to make sure they have a nice challenge in platforming. As you can see, it's a bit difficult, so you're going to have to keep your finger on the, on the sprint trigger and keep going and run through this map. Everything's melting and uh, coming around you, and then all of a sudden the swarms come chasing after you. Sometimes we put these teensies in really tough to get spots, just like here. But luckily, Barbara's got the smooth moves to get through it. Now, finally, we're going to enter into the palace. It's cool. It's a, it's a marble floor, so you can see that the ground's a bit slick, and it's uh, she slides a bit when she's running on it. Now, these guys are just trying to do their job and clean the floor, but <laughs> Barbara's here to take them out. All right, here we go. There we go. And that is the end. Freed all the teensies. And now let's take a look at another map. Our brand new musical map. Uh, it's called Orchestral Chaos. As you saw at E3, we had the, the music set. It was sort of a rock and roll sound. And now we've got a totally different soundtrack. It's more of a musical sort of orchestral score. We're also showing off a, a new world here. You can see it's sort of a jungle environment with lots of new characters, some crazy bad guys. And as you can see, everything Barbara is doing is set to music. Now, same for Murphy on the gamepad. He's basically playing a rhythm game set to this music as well. I'll let you listen. Barbara's got to move fast because there's lots of these spiky vines chasing after her. <laughs> As you can see in Rayman Legends, we're able to add a lot more depth in the backgrounds, in the foregrounds. We use a whole new lighting system, as you can see. And here we can change the environments in a snap. All of a sudden, we've gone to a stormy, rainy world after we were in a bright, sunny world. We are able to add, with the UV Art engine, add more depth this year, more lighting effects and more music <laughs> thanks for checking it out